hey guys how are you doing welcome back to petit mama youtube video if you're new here my name is Eunice. i'm a mom and i'm also a wife i do content about motherhood lifestyle and organization and i also do lots of video on appliances so on today's focus will be on this uh beko appliance this is a beko uh electric uh, cooker and as you can see this is very much on demand because i've done so many videos concerning these up kind of appliances and you guys bring up all sort of questions so today i'm just bringing an electric beko because my previous video i had done uh, how to use the beko gas oven so what i have here is a four gas burner and a two electric burner as you can see these are two electric two electric means this one can use uh the electricity and this and this can use the gas so this is a very very good option and this is very friendly and most people like this because in case you run out of gas and you cannot get gas you can always go ahead and use the electric option and these two plates are very very powerful and these are uh, plants here in the kenyan market you can get it from uh, 70,000 Kenyan shillings even up to 85,000 Kenyan shillings and this is a Beko is one of the best best brands so far in Europe and brand it's actually long lasting actually Beko comes second for me after the LG honestly I'm an LG lover so but here we are with this Beko cooker so let's do a review on this and let me just show you a few things that we have here and just to answer some of the questions that you've been throwing to me from your previous um from my previous videos so let me just start with some of the features that this uh, beko oven comes with it comes with this uh, glass cover the two electric plates that i had mentioned and the four gas burners and the metallic holder here is actually quite strong you can put any uh, heavy kind of sophoria or pan that you have and then here this is where we have the most powerful things that we need so this this set here is actually for your gas operation this one means that one this one means that one and the heat and the flame is actually very big you can see i just put one turn and it goes on so you can see how big the flame is and this one is for the small one also very good flame we have another one here also for your flame you can see how big and beautiful that is so it's just a matter of pressing in and and turning that sound that you hear the first at the beginning is what we call the spark and that only happens if you've automatically connected it to the electric socket at the back there where it automatically sparks and you don't need to use the matchbox to light it so this is an automatic connection this can only happen if you've connected it to the socket where it gives you that automatic uh, uh, flame so that's also a question that most of you guys ask you need to connect it to the socket so that it can give you that automatic uh, flame once you press it in like that so for these two here these are for switching on your electric plates and the heat is quite big because once i can go up to six up to level six and you give it time and the electric plate will be up with the heat it's actually i'm already feeling the heat and it's quite powerful you can actually cook something heavy here this is actually very good so on this other end here we have one for your timer and the timer goes up to 100 minutes this is quite good and then we have another one here and this one is now for your temperature it goes up to 250 celsius and then we have another knob here this one is actually controlling now the oven operation the kind of heat that you actually want so we have the upper grill and then this one means the lower heat comes also with the fan and then this means uh up and down you'll be having heat from both top and bottom this is also good for baking this also means both heat from both sides also with the fan and this is also for your chicken rotation so let's go ahead now and open the oven so this is quite massive i love it it's quite big you can put a whole rib goat rib over here we have the first section of the tray. so it's very spacious i love the space inside as you can see it has the first tray where you need to place something to pick it's just like the normal you know ovens and then we have this thing here that you put what's the name again rotisserie 
and then where you put your chicken and it rotates and this one you put from one end over there and it goes into the other end over there so another uh, quick uh, uh, answer to one of the questions that you guys ask me a lot is can you use your oven together with the gas cookers yes you can you can be cooking and you can also be, be, be baking at the same time secondly most people ask me what happens if i don't have the timer buy a uh, portable timer or temperature whereby you can just uh, check your temperature and then place whatever you're cooking and then remove the 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 thermometer that you are using to measure the temperature of the oven and that also makes your cooking to be easy if you don't have the temperature option for the timer also you guys ask me you can also use you know your watch your clock your stopwatch just something that helps you to know how much time you put something or how much time you need to put something so for most cooking also guys you just need also to do some research find out what temperatures you need when you're cooking a cake or ribs or whatever thing you put inside your of your oven yeah and that's it guys that's it it's a very very easy um oven i can say it's not complicated it's very direct it's very straightforward easy to use easy to explain and it's something actually i can recommend if you feel like you have a big family and you need all these cookers to be operational to make your meals easier and quicker this is something definitely you can go for and it will be at a very 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 affordable and um i think it's definitely worth it